Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Carly. And I'm Ange. And today we're watching some more Dragon Ball Super. So we've got a couple of fights teased for the upcoming episodes. We have Kale and Cauliflower taking the fight to Goku. He just showed them Super Saiyan 3. We've also got Vegeta vs. Top. Gohan and Piccolo are also fighting some Namekians currently. So there's a lot going on. Frieza eliminated Kaba as well. Frieza can go ahead and eliminate Ribrienne now. Yeah. I'm, if I'm, he's free and able to. <laughs> I'd be ready for that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now I've only seen Super once and there are a lot of moments from this Tournament of Power arc that I really like. But I can't remember which bloody episodes they're in. <laughs> so I'm kind of just guessing at the moment, waiting for specific moments. So we're only watching three episodes today though, right? Yes, I believe so. Okay, so if we get to the end of the third episode... Two or you three. you remember something that might happen in the next episode, we're not going to be watching it. Yeah, I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't know how we're going to play it. We'll have to split it up nicely. We did do something special for the Ultra Instinct. That's right, we did fall for you guys. Yeah, we had to do that because the way we were doing it, it was ending on episode 109 and that would be criminal. It would be mean, it really would. Yeah. After all you guys do for us, we thought it would be nice to do it for yeah, you. Yeah, just add the extra episode in. But also if you guys are interested in getting early access to these episodes, I'll leave a link to our Patreon down below. Also, if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. But anyway, should we get into it? Let's get into it. Animation is so much better than it than it was earlier in the series, honestly. Yeah, it looks really nice. Of all the mighty Saiyan warriors, there's one who reigns supreme. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Don't underestimate Vegeta. Yes. Oh no. Oh no! I knew you could figure it out eventually. Is she good? Kind of expecting her to bash her. Oh, if I can take it. You're my precious one, sister. Aww. The best friend I could ask for. Stop. Let's do this, Kale. She's even emotional in this state. Oh, just like that. <laughs> Can't help but smile. He's excited. Poor Goku, man. <laughs> He's gonna deal with two of them now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is gonna be sick. Yeah. You gotta love this whole affair. Nice. Helping everyone out all the time. Good to use in those scenarios. Yeah. Tien's got some of my favorite moves. Tri beam, sick as well. Mm. And multi form. The <laughs> <laughs> He's just. He causing destruction everywhere. Oh, we'll fight Ribrian. Oh, this dude's out in like one hit. <laughs> what was that? Okay, he dodged it nicely. On the bright side, it appears you brought some fascinating guests to the dance. And now I will be cutting in. <laughs> okay. Ghastly as they are, Saiyans do make fitting playthings. <laughs> yeah. Can't get enough. Just a second. You should know by now how things work, Frieza. I started fighting them first. That means I've got dibs. Go find Rubrian, please. No need to worry about Freeze, okay? I'm the one you're fighting, and don't you forget it! Oh no. I Frieza, knew he would. I told you to back off. He can't help himself. Well, Snake. The toughest force in the cosmos is gonna get even tougher! You know it! Yeah. 
I'm getting a little bit sick of them saying the toughest force in the cosmos. Well, just like hyping themselves up and stuff. I'm like, just be quiet, fight. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just getting a little irritated by it. That's all. I, I do find Kale irritating. Sorry yeah. to say, I, I just do. She's kind of cool, but I find her irritating. <laughs> I love the way they've animated Goku this episode. He looks he looks sick. Mm, extra defined. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. Yes, that was nice. <laughs> Oh my gosh, is she okay? <laughs> I love cauliflower though. Ooh. Longer, oh my gosh! The longer he's fighting, the more he's like ramping up his um his power. He's kind of like smaller in this form, right? Yeah. Oh dear. Shit. You don't want to get hit with that. Right, Gail, I don't think so though. You know? <laughs> yeah, he's too strong in this form. He's very nimble. Mm. What's he got planned? It was like so oh, calm. It broke through it back yeah. at them. I like how calm that was. It didn't have to like break a sweat. Yeah. Or scream that loud. <laughs> oh, that's sick. Got a mind of its own. Alright, Goku's controlling it. Hmm. Oh dearie me. Yeah, that one got it. Oh she saved her. Oh dang, that got her real good. Mm. Get out those things we got before this battle started. What? Are you sure? What's she talking about? <laughs> that was power. Oh, beastly, mate. I love power it. Power and might. What's this? What's all this then? Why have I got chills now? What's happening? They merged. Did they? It's, it's not even the start of it, Carly. Oh, please. Show me, I need to see. It's not even the start of it. They fused. Oh, yes! I did not see that coming! This is Kale. Plus Caulifla. <laughs> Kepler. Oh, Kepler's hot. Kepler's gonna be so strong. Kepler versus Vegito? Vegito's a bit pre preoccupied right now. He's too proud as well. <laughs> <laughs> There's that too. <laughs> I love that she's small, and she's like that powerful. One way to see what this power can do with a hard knuckle fight. Oh dear! Did you take one? She surprised herself with her speed. Oh! <laughs> that was badass. He's outmatched. Like, that's a massive increase. Yeah, he's got to call in some help. Here we go. Mm, he's concerned, you can tell. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Look at that. Dang. 
Blaze. <laughs> 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 Busy just looking at it. There's a time limit though, isn't there? No. That's with the dance. That's the guitarist. Oh. oh, okay. So he's holding out for that too. The Omni Kings have spoken. The use of Potala earrings is allowed. I thought so. <laughs> just making the rules up as they go. Look, he's trying to take him off him. Who do those uppity sane females think they are? <laughs> Their energy's climbing even higher. Oh, Vegeta's no. getting too distracted. Not the bear hug of death. Oh, yeah. Focus, Vegeta. <laughs> oh, no. The dude's arm is bigger than Vegeta. Yeah. Once we have our own merged fighter, we'll be back in control. Well then, may I suggest Android 17 and <gasps> 18 as candidates? I didn't actually think about that. That would make them well suited for merging. That would be sick. Guys, call them Android 35. That has a pleasant ah! <laughs> <laughs> service, While a combined warrior would be... <laughs> Love that. Oh, this is okay. This is getting kind of cool. Can't wait to see all the merging. Oh, I forgot this was universe too. Yeah. <laughs> no time. And just like that, the oh, Batara is <laughs> That's brutal. No, screw it, Carly. Screw universe two. Universe two. I don't give a damn. <laughs> Gosh, shut up, man. <laughs> She's got two of her players eliminated. I've missed Android 18. Me too. Come on, 18. Don't get knocked out by this. Bye. Who? I'm in love with an Android. <laughs> Something quite special about him. <laughs> about 17, mm. yeah. We love 17. You take 18, I'll take 17. That's fine with me. <laughs> I think they would both reject us. <laughs> I don't know. She's with Krillin. Big ups to Krillin. Love Krillin. <laughs> That's true. So what's he gonna do? Oh, he has to tap in to um. Ultra instinct. Ultra instinct. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's gonna have to figure out how to do it. Well, he's gone up another stage now. Yep, Luke. Gone up another another level. It's quite nice, Blue. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Goku's got to like fight really smart here because he needs to take enough time without powering up too much to get his strength back so then he can yeah. power up. Oh! Okay. Here we go. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. I love the colors so much. I've been looking forward to this fight. Capital vs. <laughs> Goku. Yeah, this is sick. Oh, we're gonna get like a little eye open from him. Okay, that was still pretty big. Oh. Oh, relax, mate. Oh my gosh. Shit. Oh, yes, Shit. yes, Ultra Instinct. Oh. Now, which one will be crowned king or queen of the same mountain? <laughs> Suspense. I think I'll treat myself and watch this show all the way to the end. There you go, that's kind of a bit of a compliment. Damn, you're awesome! I couldn't ask for a <laughs> Aww, that's nice. 
Look how effortlessly she's like creating those energy beams. Yes. Yeah. Or energy balls. Oh yeah, he's quick. Yeah, that's what the Kaioken does. Mm. Okay, now get rid of Kaioken, quick. Oh shit. You gotta hit him with something. Oh, something new, I was gonna say. I guess you heard me in advance. You tricked him. Oh no, no! No. This isn't over yet, Kefla. He got back up. Polyflo was exactly the same before he knocked him out. I don't know what he's got up his sleeve, I can't even guess. Ultra Instinct, come on, come on! Absorb it all! Come on, yes, yes. Remember Let's go! When he's pushed to his absolute maximum. <laughs> it certainly was not. Oh, she's in trouble now. Oh! <laughs> I love it when they do that. Hardly move. Ultra Instinct's cool because it's not really like the other transformations where it's just like raw power. It's really like slick. It's very slick, isn't it? Oh, it's so beautiful. Ah! And his grey eyes. Love it. Once again. His mm. own this time because of Kefla. Why is he pissed? Oh, Furious is pissed because he's stronger than him. <laughs> I love it when he reveals it. I, <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> I love it when Beerus announces that. Oh my gosh, look at it. like the prettiest energy you'll ever see. Alright, you ready for Goku vs. Kefla? All Ultra right. Instinct Goku vs. Super Saiyan Kefla. That's crazy. Next episode. <laughs> oh shit. I wonder if Sean Shemmel sounds like that in the gym. <laughs> he like puts on his ultra instinct persona. <laughs> or just the screams. Be your best, <laughs> Be your your best, best ape! ape. <laughs> oh shit. He's gotta watch it at least. He kinda is, in his own little way. He's like <laughs> sussing it all out. Mm. Have some respect. <laughs> Super Saiyan 2. Oh dang. Was I right? Yeah, it's definitely a level up. Yeah, look at the hair. That's so sick. Yeah, Super Saiyan 2 is still my favourite. It just is. It's quite special. I love the spiky hair, the lightning. Mm. Oh, look at that. Wow. Shit. Oh, yeah, they gotta be careful. That's insane. Look at this. <laughs> this is crazy. I'm very impressed. <laughs> See the green and the... Salami. And the red. Yeah, yeah. From both of them, Cauliflower and Kale. Mmm. Oh, shit. No, I'm not ready. 
Oh, <laughs> what a dodge. Oh. I hope no one gets in the way of that. No. Uh, pixelated salami. Ooh, careful there. <laughs> He's so fast. She's got no hope. I like it how he can be a little bit more defensive in this form too. Mm, yeah. Oh, I love this. This habit is especially strong with you, Vegeta. All this overthinking is limiting your fight. Ah. Listen, messages only travel through your nervous system so fast. Relying on thoughts for physical action. He's able to heed the training, heed the advice of ways. Yes. You figured out that technique we told us about. He's going to be pissed off. So that's what this is, Kakarot. You just had to show me up again. It's not like that, Vegeta. I, I mean, yeah. <laughs> I don't think Goku intended it to happen in the first place. It just kind of did. Yeah, right? Oh my gosh, he like backflipped yeah, off there. Yeah, he's really graceful in this form. Bloody Olympian. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It's one of my favourite fights. She's persistent. Oh yeah. Come on, Goku. Don't disappoint Yeah, he wasn't happy with that shot. He's like, I think so. Yeah. I'm starting to get a handle. Oh dear. <laughs> Bad news for her. <laughs> oh, that shot is sick. Mm, is it that not? is nice. Ooh, that's nice too. Such they clean animation. Up. Yeah, I know. Looked really good. Oh, he's awake. I suppose Goku has enticed him. Yeah. He's become far too much Not only did he open his eyes, he he left. Yeah. He stopped meditating. get knocked out because she, she's gonna die. Nah. Ooh. Oh, it's so clean, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. Just the force of his punch. Yep. Okay, she's pissed. They're about to go, go. 100%. Both yeah. of them. Oh. <laughs> I love this soundtrack too. Yeah, it really elevates the scene. Oh my god. Shit. Oh Got my hair. gosh! Scraped him. Careful. Ah! Come on. Oh, how is he gonna do that? He's gotta move so with it. Done. Remember, he can't fly. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> what am I saying right now? It's mental. <laughs> I love it how he's moving with it and charging it up. Yeah. Talk about multitasking. Oh dear. Oh dear. Half go. Point blank! Oh, 
<laughs> three. Three times three over. Take. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I gotta make that my ringtone. Him just yelling in Ultra Instinct. <sighs> I've been waiting for that. Dude. Mental. Mental. Flipped that over the beam. Was next level. It was like skating on the beam. No, that was some crazy shit, I will say. So that's their universe, right? Yep, just them two left against uh, Gohan and Piccolo. I can't believe that fight. Yeah, mental. I've been waiting for that for like 16 episodes. That was crazy. <laughs> oh dear, he's drained. Oh no. <laughs> it's always uh, something in it for him. Please. I will die. Oh, I don't know if I can deal with it. He's got to hide somewhere. But Freeze is going to leave him alone for now, which is good. Yeah. I mean, they're on the same team, so. Oh, man. I have been waiting to film this, like these stretch of episodes for weeks, months. I have. Uh, we had to tick off the Ultra Instinct, but like this was the one I was really looking forward to. Yeah. Like you've seen a couple of them so far. So when we started putting some like highlights on the channel of Dragon Ball Super, because we weren't originally planning to do everything. Uh, when we started off, there were a handful of episodes that I was wanting to get to. One of them was the Ultra Instinct episode. The other one was um, the Roshi episode. I really wanted to get to this moment. This moment. This was incredible. Uh, I remember when I watched it for the first time with my cousin when it first came out. Man does the flip with the Kamehameha. Yeah, yeah, and he like kind of uses it to like keep his... It's like he was, um, like, kind of like break dancing, but like, it reminded me of like, he was on some skateboard doing some flip moment. It was epic. And then oh. it gets capped off perfectly with the three take point blank Kamehameha. Yep. Yep. That elevates it even more. My goodness. Uh. Incredible scream too. I love the soundtrack in the back. I love the animation. I loved him like moving with it because we we know that he can't fly. Yeah. And he's got to like dodge this massive energy wave, and we're thinking like, how does he do this? How does he like get out of the way? And he rides it with his own energy, right up to her face. Oh shit! That... I watched that shit over and over again. So good. That's crazy. Oh my gosh, everything about that. It was like quite a quick scream, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, like a, a powerful sort of. But like, he was aggressive. Oh man. Like, that's why like I watch it in up dub. With his face? Yeah. Mm. That's specifically why I watch it in dub. You got it for Goku. Sean. Have you compared? I have. Oh, you've seen sub two? I have. Look. We'll leave it there. If people like the sub, that's fine. I personally don't like the sub for Dragon Ball. I see you guys in the comments all the time. People, like, can't get over the fact that we're watching dub. But they're nice about it. It's kind of funny. With, like, other uh, dubs that we've done, people are not so nice about it. But Yeah, Dragon Ball dub, like, the English dub for Dragon Ball is very highly respected. Yeah. As, as it should be. Yeah, that was incredible. The whole way that that scene was constructed was mm -hmm. was really good. Uh, we had Kefla in these stretch of episodes as well. Yep. Got to see a bit of fusion, which was good. Yeah, I didn't actually guess that they were going to fuse. I kind of felt that it wasn't the end of them when um, Goku knocked them off the edge there, when they were still in their separate bodies. But yeah, I didn't expect them to fuse. Well, you get tricked because you're not allowed external, yeah, you know, things and accessories and stuff like that. So 
when you've got those rules in mind, you don't expect certain things to pop up. And then when they do, the easy plot devices, Zenny's loving what they're seeing. So they're kind of just making the rules up on the spot. Well, if it's entertaining enough, I guess. Yeah. It's all right. So then you get surprised at least. We also saw Roshi get away with it, which was nice with the container, containment. Wave, yeah. Thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah Evil containment. Good. Vegeta wants to get to, to Ultra Instinct. Uh, I feel bad for him because he, he's never really the first to achieve a power up level. Actually, he, he powered up from Super Saiyan 1 earlier than Goku, I believe. Don't quote me on that. My Z knowledge is meant to be pretty good, but I'm pretty sure he ascended, not to Super Saiyan 2, but I'm pretty sure he ascended before Goku did. Like that bulky form. Um, but ever since they've been like side by side in competition with each other, yeah. it's never been him first. No, not really. But maybe he'll actually take what Weiss was saying seriously now because there's more like desperation to. He's seen Goku do it. And he's like, okay, I remember we saw the flashback of Weiss telling him how to achieve that. Yeah. So um, I know he said, especially for Vegeta, that's going to be difficult because Vegeta's sort of like more emotional in his fights. Yeah. And it's harder for him to like just let go and rely on instinct. So mm -hmm. I think it'll be a greater achievement if Vegeta achieves autonomous ultra instinct. Yeah. That's interesting. That's an interesting point. Um. Yeah, because Goku and Vegeta are definitely different fighters. The first time Goku went into Ultra Instinct, though, uh, I think it, uh, a lot of it was um, just the fact that the circumstance that he was in, and then also Goku's very gifted. He's a very gifted fighter where Vegeta has to earn a lot of his yeah. abilities. I'm not trying to take away from Goku. I love Goku. <clears throat> Big Goku fan. So, um, But I'm just stating that, like Vegeta has stated it before, Goku is just like a very gifted fighter. He's got that innate capability there. Yeah. In the next stretch of episodes, we'll probably get... Again, I, I don't know. Um, This is where it starts to get really hazy for me. Okay, that's kind of good. But um, we'll probably move on to the Namekians fighting with Gohan and Piccolo. Mm -hmm. The last two left from... Is it Universe 6? Yeah. It's not looking good for them. No, not Namekians really. Namekians don't seem like... You know, that strong. No offense. Yeah. And then also, Jiren got up. Mm-hmm. Now, I remember him saying a couple of episodes back, if there's a warrior worthy to challenge me... Oh, dear. You know, come forth. Yeah, because I guess Goku has, like, improved his abilities already. Yeah. I think he's tickled the itch for Jiren. Okay, I guess that'll be a really good fight as well. Um, Goku's like so drained right now though, so I don't know what he's going to do. Maybe he needs another like power up. Yeah, well, I mean, I presume now that he's out of Ultra Instinct, we've had a lot of Goku fighting recently. We've yeah. had a lot of the Goku, uh, Kale, Cauliflower, Kaba, a lot of the Saiyans. Mm -hmm. I presume we'll get to see some of the other characters a little bit more now. Yes, just as I'd a little... love to see... Uh, Frieza and Ribrienne. You've been saying that multiple times this video. Look, I'm actually happy to have had a break from Ribrienne. I Same. feel like that's quite necessary, <laughs> but now I'm ready. Yeah. I'm ready for her to perish. Yeah, I, I do presume that we're going to see more of the other characters now for a little bit. Um, Because we have had that little Saiyan mini arc, mini tournament here, I guess, inside the tournament. So... Yeah, some other characters will shine for a little bit. We got to see the androids a little bit. You're loving 17. I'm loving 17. Mm. He is just incredibly special. Yeah, I think the two that I've seen you get the most um, excited about in the tournament so far have been Roshi and 17. Mm. Which is interesting. Yeah. Because they weren't like your favorite characters by any means. But no. they're getting you the most hype, which is good to see that other characters can do that for you. Yes, I'm quite happy about that too. They're yeah. just like giving all of the love to just Goku or whatever. Yeah. You know, that would be kind of boring if no one else was getting the love as well. Mm -hmm. Have you had a favorite episode so far in the tournament? I know there's like a hundred odd in, in the actual show, but... 
I loved 105. Roshi. 105 was special. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that was next level. This. Yeah, this is good too. Oh my god. I preferred this to the even the Ultra Instinct transformation, like the first well, one. Yeah, this like gets to show it in its glory. Oh you know? yeah, the fight was so good. I loved every bit of the fight. Just how like, um, how they animate the Ultra Instinct, like dodging, like him dodging an Ultra Instinct. Yeah. Um. And then, like, you're thinking, like, how is he going to win when his combat isn't actually working? Like, his melees? Mm, yeah. And then you just know in your head, you're like, oh, there's going to be a, a Kamehameha involved here. What a Kamehameha that was. That's dude. my favorite one. That's yeah. up there with the instant transmission one that he did against Cell in, oh. the, in, the, in the Cell games. Um, that was next level, too. I remember losing my shit when I saw that. Uh, I would put this one up there, though. That's pretty big that you can compare a Kamehameha with one in Z. Yeah. Like, to Super. Yeah. Super's done well there. Yeah, definitely. No, Super does really well in, in some areas. Uh, just like that. Uh, one thing that Super does really well is when the animation looks really nice and the color palette starts going crazy, it looks really, really nice. I liked uh, Kefla's... Last energy wave there, how it was a mix between the green and the red energy from both the two girls. Yeah, I like how they do that. They get all creative when the fusions happen and, like, incorporate things from either person. Yeah. It's really nice. She had, like, the red pixelated salami pattern. <laughs> oh, yeah, the salami pa pattern. Yeah, they do that with the pixelated stuff. Uh, I quite like those pixelated looking beams, though. <laughs> yeah, I guess it's a bit of a look in itself. Yeah. But then with the blue... And then the Ultra Instinct, like, oh, what is it? It's like heat waves almost. It's yeah. That sort of pattern. The Ultra Instinct has my favorite aura. Although I think mm. my favorite transformation in Super might be the Kaoken blue. I'm not sure. I really like that. It is nice. You're right. Uh, Kefla's design. What did you think of Kefla's design? I loved it. I loved it actually more than, mm, I'd probably go Cauliflower, Kefla, Kale. Yeah, I thought... I liked the way she looked. Uh, I thought they could have done a little bit more with her clothing. Yeah, I didn't really like the leggings. They weren't flattering. Yeah, I don't know. I like to critique the fusions. Just yes. to see Because like, they're so exciting and they look really cool. In Super Saiyan, though, it looked really, really good. Yeah, I guess the, really good. the clothes could have been distracting if they did a little bit more. I know it's not that big of a deal, but I like to talk Possibly, about it. Possibly, but like Vegito looks sick. Like, you know, that's pretty quite basic. a detail. Yeah. No. You know, he's got his... Doesn't he have, like, his... No, you're confusing that with um, GT from Gogeta. Oh, crap. Yeah. Gogeta's with the um the dance. Yeah, That's from right. the dance. Okay. Vegito, Vegito's clothes um are just kind of like a hybrid between... It's it's more like Goku's flipped. Think about it that way. Oh, right, yeah, he's got yeah, the blue okay. underneath the orange. Yeah. It's almost like that. Thank you so much for watching our reaction. If you liked it, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It would really help us out. For early access to all of our reactions, you can support us on Patreon if you'd like. And yeah, thank you so much again. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.